is up guys, MC Build it here and I'm back with another video. Today I'm going to be doing a tutorial on this awesome vending machine that I uh, made all by myself. Um, it's very small and compact, way better compared to uh, my old one right here, my older version that uses pistons and everything. So I have a silent one that doesn't have a huge piston and that does not have this whole, you know, big old deal it's gonna take a lot of space in survival so mine is small and compact and it's way better than the old one um, I thought of this eh, quite a while ago. where is it all right I thought of this quite a while ago um, and I just uh, want to do a tutorial on it. um so it's very small and compact and um yeah so I am going to say a few things guys thank you so much for 100 subscribers guys I believe I have 118 as of now and uh, it's amazing thank you so much for the support and everything guys um, I know you guys love those uh, redstone tutorials and um, I have so many things that I've done out here you know with experimenting and uh, working with redstone, you know, elevators to, uh, you know, anything. So, I would love to see 200 subscribers very soon. Maybe by Christmas or something, guys. Thank you so much. Um, and I will be doing some specials. Uh, maybe some Hunger Games or mini maps or uh, even... Uh, I might do some... Uh, what's it called? Or maps I might even do some of that so stay tuned guys for all those and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get into this video Perfect. all right so what is this all right never mind <laughs> I just got a text all right so what we're gonna do is I'm just gonna demonstrate this so it takes five sand for this you can make it how many sand you want but I have five set for this one and it'll give you a piece of steak so you put five in the chest doesn't matter how you lay it out you can do it like that and then boom and it gives you your steak this the thing is it comes out of this side you can like block that with a wall or something uh, but yeah then you can eat your yummy yummy steak and so you can put any item in here like you can even do uh, you can even do uh, one two three and you'll see here it doesn't give you it but if you put in something like 60 it will give you one steak because it's not set up in a repeating system all right you can do that if you want you can set up a side repeater over here that goes up to this dispenser so that it'll turn on the repeating area and keep dispensing if you have a long pulse but um that's just that guys so it's very simple and easy to build and i'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys so um, I do not have the specific items set out for survival yet, unless they're over here. Oh, yes they are, alright. Uh, so you're going to need three redstone torches, five redstone repeaters, one redstone comparator, four redstone dust, two chests, uh, some blocks of your choice, and, uh, hopper. Uh, three hoppers actually one piece of glowstone if you need it for light and one dispenser all right so that's what you're going to need for this build guys well, let's go ahead and destroy that so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and build a little platform just like this and it's going to be a one two three four by one two three four up you can see this at the very last two blocks to the left here. It's going to have too wide of a wall. And you're going to do wool across this. You're going to need some kind of wool or glowstone or glass. Because that's how it dis... Alright. 
So, then what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and... Oh, wait. Alright. We are going to... Gosh, I keep falling. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and get our hoppers out and stuff. So, what we're going to do is we're going to come out uh, over here. And we're going to place a hopper going down. So, I'm going to have to do that. So, we're going to have a hopper going down. And then over here, we're going to have a hopper going into this block. So, it should look like that. And you can, like, delete that block. And then you can place a chest right here. So, it should look just like this, guys. Coming out of this hole, you're going to have a hopper, which is a notch facing to the right here. And then this one going down into this chest. And then uh, it'll go over to your wrist. So we can go ahead and come out. One, two, three, four, five. All right. Five long right here. We're going to go up. And then we're going to come out like that. Maybe three. And then we're going to come back all the way and then stop. And we're going to place a block oh, a block up like that. And then we're going to delete that block and it should look exactly like this, guys. So it should be five and then up and then skip and then up and then three and then four up. So I can just delete these just for spacing. Um... So, when you actually, when you do this, you need to dig down two. So, like, that's pretty easy, actually. So, like, this is your floor. You're going to go down one, two. Um, unless you absolutely wanted uh, to make this, n make it one block, and you just take the notch going into that block, and then a chest under it. Uh, to chest to the side of it but I decided to go down to make it a lot easier so what we're gonna do is we're gonna make a comparator coming out of this and then we're gonna go redstone two locks and a repeater on two ticks delay then we're gonna go over here and we're gonna have a repeater on I believe four ticks delay let me check that yes all right we're gonna go three more repeaters and we're gonna delay these as well so we're gonna go three ticks and then we're gonna go two ticks and then we're gonna go four ticks should look just like this all right just like that all right now what we're gonna do is one on this torch we're gonna put this torch on top of this block and then a block on top of that torch eh, with a torch on and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna come over the side one and place a bead of redstone dust and then we're gonna delete this block right here and we're going to place a dispenser oh, a dispenser facing the orange wool all right now it should look like that little circuit and everything and then and after this we're going to go ahead and place a block right here all right I believe it has yes it does have some dust on it and a torch coming out it locks this hopper right here and then so nothing passes through it then once the pulse hits it it unlocks it so stuff can fall all right um now i forgot to mention guys that you are going to need sand for this uh build so you're going to need uh 19 sand which is extremely easy to get if you're in survival and creative of course um, so what we're going to do is we're going to go up to this top hopper and put 18 in. So we're going to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. And then 1, 2, 3, 4. And that's how that should be. And then in the bottom hopper, we're going to place one piece of sand. And then that's how that... And then that's how that's going to be. And... Now we're going to go ahead and place a chest. 
I believe. Yes. All right. Um, we're going to go ahead and place a uh, chest inside of here, so I have to get a chest out. And we're going to place another hopper. Actually, I knew I was missing something. We need three hoppers instead of two. That's what it called for. So, um. We're going to go ahead and take this hopper here. We're going to place a hopper going into it. Alright. Then we place a uh, thing on top of the hopper. A chest. So it should look just like that. And above this chest, we're going to place uh, our glowstone. Or glass. Or wool. Uh, no, wool won't work. Glass or something. So that will work. Alright. And then... We have a little light source and everything, and it works. So, uh, now we can go ahead and get our sand, uh, I mean our sign and our item frame. So, we're going to place an item and a sign here, and I'm going to write in, um, five. Whoops, sand. Alright. Okay, so it just look like that, and you can put anything you want in here. So I want steak and potatoes, or potatoes, uh, or something, you know, baked potatoes. Boom, and you just place them in here. Uh, many, <laughs> any amount you want, and then you just place in, let's say five. So one, two, three, four, five, and it will suck that up and give you your food or whatever. Now, if you want to fix this thing from going to the side, what you're going to have to do is uh, get another block and go up the side here for your wall. Man, so let me get symmetrical. Alright, so now it should work better. Here, let's try this. One, two, three, four, five. There. Alright. You can put a block on top of it, too, if you want. <laughs> there <laughs> all right so um that's it guys for this build is a very short and fast uh build as you can see it's very small and compact so it'll fit in a survival world um it is great um so yeah guys uh please rate comment and subscribe i hope you guys enjoyed this video i will have more tutorials out for you guys um, I know I have not been active in a while, but I will be now. So, yeah, thank you for 100 subscribers, guys. I will be doing some special videos very, very, very soon. And um, I have some tutorials, as you can see down here, that I need to do. I have a 3x3 piston door that I made myself, and uh, it works like a charm. Um very nice and smooth no lag in it at all so uh, I will be showing that to you guys very very soon um, maybe this week or next but uh, yeah so I hope you guys enjoyed this video please rate comment and subscribe and I will see you guys